This morning, two more school communities are on alert after a trend of threats against schools continue to plague school districts across the country. Let's get straight out to Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Marcy Jones, who's in Waterbury this morning. Good morning, Marcy. This is the fifth or sixth time that this has happened in just a couple of weeks. So what do we know right now? It is. Good morning. Well, the threat here at Crosby is still being investigated. However, the threat against Danbury High School was investigated and it was determined that it was not a credible threat. However, both schools this morning will have increased police presence. We are told that Waterbury police were alerted of the threat against Crosby High School when a social media post was brought to their attention yesterday. Now, specifics have yet to be released, but it involves the threat of a shooting. Police in Danbury have made an arrest of a juvenile following a threat made against Danbury High School. Now, while details of that threat are not clear, it was quickly determined that it was a hoax. Danbury High School will also have an increased law enforcement presence felt throughout the day. Now, back out here live, this is really something that we've been talking about for a couple of weeks now. Schools across the country are trying to find the way to deal with this, especially with law enforcement. It takes time, money, of course, as well as they're trying to limit the disruption it causes to the academic schedule and discourage copycat incidents. Reporting live in Waterbury, Marcy Jones, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Marcy, thank you. Time is